At the deepest level, reality isn't solid. It's a quantum blur. Particles exist as probabilities, not things. In quantum mechanics, nothing has a definite position or state until an interaction happens, a measurement, an observation. Only then does the cloud of possibilities collapse into one outcome. But that's just the first step. Your brain then has to make sense of that collapsed event. Billions of neurons take those raw sensory hits and run them through filters evolved for one purpose. Survival. They compress noisy, imperfect data into a clean, stable world of objects, colors, and stories. You don't see quantum fuzz. You see a solid chair, a clear room, a continuous you moving through it. Consciousness sits on top of this pipeline, like a narrator, reading the final draft and saying, yeah, that's reality. That's me. So from quantum blur to neural processing to the story in your head, reality is less like a photograph and more like a user interface. Your brain builds on demand. You're not just looking at the world. You're watching your brain finish the job reality started.